So we're back at Boosie States right now, and a lot has changed since last time I was here. So what's going on right here? We almost up, man. We got a few inspections to go before everything done. They were number frames when you came back the last time. Right. Now, it wasn't black. All the siding is on. Windows, electrical. Exactly. Next time you come back, you're going to see a container. You're going to see a container match going up. OK. Well, let's go check it out. So you got the grass put down. We got some grass put down. I'm thinking about putting another pool right here. So this will be your third pool? Yeah, because I'm, I'm putting a big gate that's separated right here, like a subdivision gate, because this is going to be Gotham City. Hmm. And I'm thinking about putting a small pool right here so they don't have to come swim in my pool, you know? <laughs> OK. <laughs> All right. Yeah. So each of these is three stories? Two stories. Two stories. Oh, OK, so the second story is just high. Yep. It's got the extra windows up there. Each one, two stories. And when you got land, you the man. man. I mean, right. you, you can do so much stuff, man. Uh, next, I think I'm going to build a subdivision. Uh, I've been talking with some real rich guys in, uh, in Saudi Arabia, and uh, I think they're going to uh, they gonna front me to build, uh, to build me a lot of homes on my, on my, on my acres. Huh. And I pay them back, you know, but that's what I think I'm going to go with next out of the container home. I'm going to build a subdivision on my land. OK, so how many total homes? So you got four homes here. Yeah. There's one home back there. Yeah. There's the main house, so that's six. There's yeah. the tree house, right? <laughs> that's seven. Yeah, I wouldn't call that a home, but it's an upstairs. You can live in it, right? Yeah, yeah. Uh, how many bedrooms is that? One, one or two bedrooms? Uh, two bedrooms. Two bedrooms, so it's a home. Yeah. So it's a place to live, so that's seven. What am I missing? That's all right now. For I mean, now? Yeah. So then you're gonna put up some containers and you can live in those too? Yeah, I'm putting up a container mansion. What is Already that? Already got eight, uh, eight 40 foot cube containers. We just ticked on the septic stuff and all that, so he, he's designing me a, a container mansion. And, okay. Um, I mean, I just keep on going, Vlad. Okay. Can we check out some of these, uh, some of these homes? Yeah. When I was here last time, there was, this was just skeletons, pretty much. Yeah, no, nah, it's not skeletons anymore. Okay. We almost there. Mmm, still smell the wood. Yeah. <laughs> like it. I like it. Okay, so each of these has, like, its own balcony, pretty much. Yep, yep, I'm, uh, I'm doing balconies off each one. I ain't made up my mind whether I want to do the glass balconies or the, the steel balconies, but I'm going to design each one a little different. Okay. One of them, I'm going to do two bedrooms, one at the top, one at the bottom. Another one I'm gonna do like the uh, the Mexican homes when you travel out of town, like open area, at the bottom with a few with a few places to sit. I'm gonna design every one with the furniture in a different way. Okay. You can do two bedrooms, or you can do one bedroom, or you can you know depends. Okay. And who's gonna live here? Like, what's the plan? Is it for your kids, or are you gonna rent it out? Well, this summer, I'm moving in my Batman mansion. I'm putting my kids over here. Okay. This is going to be done. And I want to see how they going to take care or live by themselves. Because, you know, all of them 18, 17, 16, 15. So I want to put them on their own and see who is what. You right. Know? <laughs> Do they have to pay the bills? Oh, yeah. They're going to have to. And, right. and I'm the landlord. Right. Oh, they're going to rent it out from you. No, I'm just saying I'm the landlord, so I'm going to be coming over here checking. <laughs> you know, I want to see who's responsible out my kids right. who... Keep the place clean. Right, right. right. And I want, I want them to not have to call on me. I want them to, when they get their allowance, go and get their own food for they... You know, I want to see who's going to be a junkie motherfucker. All this for future plans. I'm testing them this summer. Okay. I'm testing them. I'm really testing them. So, uh, yeah, man. I mean, in the future, there's no telling what I'm what I'm gonna do with them, you know. Okay. So each of these homes, these four that are in this section right here, how much is it gonna cost you to build each one of these? If you just kind of eyeball it. I don't know, cause I don't know what I put on the uh, permit. Okay, so we'll just leave that off. <laughs> so can we actually walk onto the balcony, or is it? Yeah, you can walk gonna, onto the balcony, but I, I don't know how. Let me see. Oh, nah. 
Nah, you good. You good. Okay. Yeah, you good. So we we are on the we are on the balcony right now yeah. of one of your four homes in Boosie Town. Yeah. Is there a name for it or Gotham City? Gotham City. Yeah. Got it. Gotham City. Gotham City. I'm gonna call it Boosie Town for short. <laughs> and then there's gonna be streets, actual street names here. Yeah. Uh, the streets gonna come from in there, and I got. I got some some stuff coming from the back area. Once I once I get once I to figure out this pool situation, I don't want to have to take nothing up. Okay. Cause when you get your permit, you can't. Once you lay something down, you can't. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> <laughs> that's it. Right. So I'm thinking about putting that pool right here. So you're gonna put a pool here, even though there's a pool right there. Yeah. So they don't come swimming in my pool. And I'm finna put a, uh, I talk, just talked to some um, construction guys. I'm finna put a go-kart track through the woods. A go-kart track? Yeah, a dirt go-kart track, though. That's dope. To where the dirt flying up everywhere. Okay. Yeah. Right, because you're on 88 acres, right? Yeah, something like that. That's amazing. The Batman one over there. Yeah. Is it any different from what we saw it last time? Yeah, I got the lights on now. Let's go check it out. Vlad, did I have be beds upstairs last no. time? Nope. All right, so this is the Batman mansion? Yeah. Okay. And we were here last Batman time. Batman was my favorite movie. Okay, which one? Everyone. I mean, Everyone. I'm a Batman fan. I think the facade was there last time. Well, I don't know. See, like the outside looks a little different. You know, all the stone it. and everything. So, but this is the bigger one. So all those are smaller. So all those are one and two bedrooms? Yeah. And this is how many bedrooms? Four and a half. Really. Four and a half yeah. bedrooms. Yeah. Okay, well, let's go check it out. You got a pool table. Yeah, I got the pool table. Batman colors. Mm. Big track life. Boss man. Made man. Batman estates. Oh, you got it all custom. <laughs> yeah, I got it custom. West Garfield Street. Ray Hatch Pops. Okay, the bar. Oh, so uh, the kitchen wasn't here before. Nah, the kitchen wasn't here. I'm okay. Up, Black. All right, so you got the marble uh, island. Yeah. I like it. Why would you live here as opposed to the main house? Because I don't have enough people that live in the main house. My, when my kid's not living with me, I mean, I just don't have enough people to live in it. So it's just so too, too big for you? It's kind of too big for you. Yeah. I got four people living in that house with me. Okay, so this is gonna be all to yourself. Yeah, I can walk around naked here. <laughs> yeah, you're right. You always have, every time I come over, there's always a ton of people in the house, so. Like, bro. There's no like, privacy, I guess. And my studio's there, so I want that to be separate from anything. I think I'm finna Airbnb it up there because I got some big companies offering some crazy money. Huh, yeah. Shoot it. So I'm just gonna come back here for like a year and just, get, you know, too damn big. I love it. All right, let's go check it out upstairs. Yep. My lights on now, baby. The lights on now. It was yeah. on last time. Nah, nah, I it ain't was had dark. no electricity. It was completely dark. This the Joker room. I think this is gonna be my youngest son room. He the baddest. Joker room is different. We got beds now. Joker, your favorite villain? Yep. It's got the massage. It's the massage bed. Yep. Okay. Massage bed. I'm gonna get you right. Okay. You got a bathroom in there. Nice. Marble all over the walls. Yeah. I like it. This is like a kid's room pretty much. Yeah, like a kid's room. So when the, the next batch of kids comes around, <laughs> the next two, this is where they'll be uh, hanging out with dad. Yeah, hopefully. All right, let's check out this room. This is the Catwoman room. Yeah, waiting on my bed for that right now. And I, I really like the view of the forest. No one owns the land behind this. Me. Oh, so how far does it go back? Oh, it goes all the way back down there to the street. So oh. you could build another 10 houses here. Yeah, yeah. At least. Oh, and you got a putting green in the back. Yeah. Okay. You golf? Nah. I started golfing recently, man. You should try it. Hell no. Nah. All right. I don't even know how to golf at top golf. So the master bedroom. All marble floors. Yep. The bed will go right here in the middle. Yep, the bed will go You're right going to do the giant, the giant huge bed again? Oh or? yeah, my bed probably from that wall, from right here, all the way to the end. I got a, I got a, Crazy bed, the TV pop out the end. All this, right, so this, this is the bathroom. my bathroom, yeah. So you got the huge double shower. Yeah. And then you got marble. Yep. 
Yeah, the mirror TVs. Aha. See-through tub. Oh, okay. So you got the ill chandelier. Yeah. With another one over here. And that's the walk-in closet over here. Yeah, it's the closet. Nice. Clearly not enough to have all your stuff in it. Nah, <laughs> that's, that's why you got the master out. closet. I'm only bringing the top-notch shit, the 20 best outfits, 20 best shoes. Right, all the higher designer shit. Yeah. Oh, there's a floor below? Yeah. Oh, it's like a basement. They working on this now. It's the theater right here. Oh, this is a real they theater. You here. could basically lie in, in, in beds watching movies here. Yeah. It's gonna be a projector or a LCD screen? LCD screen. Okay. Like 100 inch? 120 inch. This leads outside. Yeah. There's some couches out here or something, you know. Thinking about covering it up, you know, like the Mexicans have their backyards with the with the hanging lights. Yeah. Ah, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, you got a little stairs that goes up to the pool. Yeah. You dope, man. All right, so there you have it. We were here earlier last year. Now we're here in 2024. We get to see all the progress. The main, the main house in the back looks way more developed. The, the four houses in the back are starting to come up, you know, and have all the bones and everything. We didn't actually even get to look inside last time, but, but this is dope, man. This is dope. When do you think all this will be done and uh, everyone can move I would in? Say, I would say uh, it's, it's February now, probably. I say about four months, three months, three, four months. So about June, July? Yep. It's gonna be a hot summer, man. Yeah. Man, well, <laughs> congratulations, man. What you're doing here, uh, you know, is basically what I consider unbelievable. I appreciate it. You know, it. I know a lot of people who have impressive homes, but to actually build something from scratch, from just a plot of land with a bunch of trees to turn to this, man, is amazing. And I can't wait to come back to see, you know, how it all turns out and to see what else you're going to do. Because you got the containers coming and yeah, everything else. Like yeah. that. It just, it doesn't seem like you ever want to stop. Yeah, I'm not going to stop. I mean, I, I'm just happy that after that video we did, bro, I gave a lot of people motivation, bro. Yeah. A lot of little dudes, a lot of people were seeing me and like they was motivated by what I was doing. So I appreciate I'm motivating people by... I just doing what I do, man. I mean, right, right. And, and I think I think that the main point was is that very few people could go and, and buy a ten million dollar home, yeah. right? But a lot of people that are watching this, who especially live in in the South and live in rural areas, live in the Midwest, they could buy a piece of land for relatively cheap. And like you said in the very beginning of the last video. 20,000 here, 20,000 there, slowly build it up over the course of years and eventually have what it is that they really, really want without having to put up a whole bunch of money up front. And I think that's the inspirational part. You know what I'm saying? So, congrats on what you pulled off, man. Can't wait to see how it develops in a few months. Yeah, we're gonna be back. We're gonna be back in a few months. Shout out to everybody, man. I didn't motivate it. I just wanna let y'all know y'all could do it too because I came home from prison in 2014 with zero dollars. Yes. So. And now look, that's what it is, my man.